What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for, for future readings. This is an uh, Oracle card reading for Sign of Pisces. I heard Pisces on my, after I got done with the last video, so that was my confirmation to do Pisces Oracle reading. This could resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Hater, or Jupiter charts. Um, it's been, um, don't forget the basics. If time is fluid, energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. It's very important to only take the messages that resonate with you. There's millions, billions of people in the world and tons of Pisces. So it's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest, okay? Um, Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. You guys really are the best. Um, I truly appreciate all the love and support. It helps support a single mother of two kids, one of her income streams. So I truly do appreciate all the love and support to my channel. I just want to say that. Okay. I'm using three decks for the Oracle card readings. Um, this is for April of 2022. However, like I said in Capricorn's reading... Um, um, everybody's on different time of life paths. So even though it's for April of 2022, for some of you guys, it's still, we have 11 days left in March. For some, it could still resonate March. Um, for some, it could be April. For some, it could be later. Um, there's so, um, there's tons of people. So, you know, however it resonates in your time and life path is what I'm trying to say. Okay. If it does resonate. Okay. Spirit messages you have for the sign of Pisces. Managerial position, shocking job loss is what I just heard. Those two messages what I just heard. Managerial position and shocking job loss is what I just heard. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you, some kind of managerial position energy and some kind of shocking job loss. So if this resonates for you, Pisces, I feel for some, well, it could go several ways, I feel. For some of you guys, I feel... Um, you could get promoted to a managerial position or for some, and it could be you or somebody you're connected to, just let you know these messages. It could be for you or somebody you're connected to. I feel for some, um, you're going to get promoted to a manager or somebody you're connected to is going to get promoted to managerial position in some shape, some shape, some shape, form or fashion. For some, I feel maybe somebody currently in a managerial position is about to experience a shocking job loss, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. Um, or And I also feel it can go, either you're going to experience a shocking loss, job loss or somebody you're connected to is about to experience a shocking job loss. Those are the three ways I feel it can go. But you plug it in however it resonates, if it resonates for you, Pisces. Um, this could resonate via Pisces in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, or Jupiter charts. Number 17 or 42 could be very significant number, 17 or 42. It can be possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible jersey number, possible, um, yeah, 17 or 42. Uh, we have um, air sign energy and earth sign energy in, in your um, animal spirit cards. So for some, you could be dealing with an air sign or an earth sign, possibly. If you are, they could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or no, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. If you are dealing with those people in your life, possibly. Okay. Move, big booty. Um, I call him Big Booty Judy. You got a big old booty. Crow spirit, co-create with spirit. Uh, uh Oh, okay. Be careful. I'm on the video. A particular Pisces is about to start receiving very, 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 very heavy spiritual downloads. Very heavy. Do not be afraid of these. Roll with the flow. Wow, Pisces. So if this resonates with you, I heard you're about to start receiving very heavy downloads so not just you know a few i mean very heavy downloads so whoever this is for come here baby whoever this is for i think you work in the spiritual realm or you meditate a lot and you're very spiritual um however that resonates um I feel it could go both ways. You don't have to work in the tarot card reading community or spiritual community or do anything in spiritual community. You could just be very spiritual, um, religious or not. 
but uh, do but however that resonates i heard you're about to start getting very heavy downloads now heavy downloads that could be clear audience now the, you know that could be clear audience messages from spiritual realm like i get so heavy clairvoyant which is visions from the spiritual realm like the type oracle gets so heavy or it could be um i'm just using her as an example because she's an amazing tarot card reader um with clairvoyant messages or it could be um dreamscape abilities like you you're sleeping in the dreams today and you get heavy downloads through the dreamscape um one or all those things but it's definitely spiritual realm related. It's not like mental health issue related. It's spiritual realm related. Um, I heard it's going to um, scare you, but basically roll with the punches. So roll with the flow, go with the flow. Don't let it overwhelm you. Don't let it scare you. Um, who This person has received them in the past, but they have fought them. Okay, I heard this person has received them in the past, but they have fought them. So if this resonates for you, Pisces, you have received these downloads from the spiritual realm in the past. True spiritual downloads. It's not fakey, fakey stuff. Maybe you thought you were going crazy, maybe. I know when I started receiving mine two years ago, I thought I was going crazy. So maybe you thought you were going crazy. I don't know. But I just heard, roll with it, that it's the real freaking deal. So if, the, if that resonates for you, it might just be for one of you guys in the past. You have received them in the past. It sounds like maybe you quit receiving them or they became minimal. But I, they're about to come hard and they're about to come fast. And they are about to come, 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 come is what it sounds like. I heard roll with the punches. So roll with the flow is what it. Um, I'm taking here. Co-create with spirit. Spirit is calling. The spiritual realm is calling you. Um, I heard you fought it. So, I mean, it sounds like you didn't want them, uh, whoever that's for. But they're they're wanting you to answer the call Pisces if that resonates for you you can be masculine or femme okay otter spirit you're never alone someone's grandmother is about to visit them in the dreamscape very soon they're about to visit you for a reason they want you to do something very significant in the in the world 3d world it is very important. Holy crap. Whoa. So you plug it in how it resonates, Pisces. So we're heavy spiritual energy in here. Holy crap. So you could be masculine or feminine, however that resonates for you. But I heard um, so one of you guys is grandmother. It sounds like they're deceased um, because why else are they visiting you in the dreamscape? If they were here with you on the 3D plane, they would not be visiting you in the dreamscape. You'd go to their house and have some, you know, fried chicken and green beans with them or tea and crumpets or whatever you have with them. Um, but so I think they're deceased. Um, obviously, I obviously think they're deceased if they're visiting you in the dreamscape. My dad did that two years ago. And that, and then I started receiving clear audience um, messages. So, I mean, everything happens for a reason. I'm just saying. So I obviously think they're deceased. You have a deceased grandmother that's about to um, visit you in your dreamscape and they want you to do something very important here on earth in the 3D plane. Right. It is very important, very important. It is very important, I heard. It's very important. So whoever this is resonating with, it hasn't happened yet, it's about to. And this hasn't happened yet either, it's about to. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Heavy spiritual energy, holy moly. For some, your grandmother could be an earth sign because they're pulling in earth sign energy strong in this one. A Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo, they could have Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo in their your deceased grandmother. They could have Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Midham energy charts, possibly. Um, but wow, holy crap, Pisces. This is, this is a good one. Oh my gosh. Protection from a powerful friend. Heavy, 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 heavy spiritual protection. Many spiritual round Pisces here. I am pulling in. I think I might be talking to some tarot card readers. And or spiritual spiritualists, positive light side spiritualists, tarot card readers, or um, Reiki masters, Reiki healers, shamans, or something of that nature. Whether you actually get on here and and 
on a public platform and do Tara or spiritual community type stuff or not, I'm, I'm talking to this. I'm talking to you guys. I'm, I, I'm pulling you guys. It's so strong. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard heavy, heavy, heavy spiritual protection, heavy. Um, spiritual, spiritualist Pisces, whoever you are. Now, you can be religious and be spiritual, or you can be spiritual and not be religious. I just want to make that very abundantly clear. I do not judge anybody, whether they're strictly spiritual or whether they are religious and spiritual. Um, however, that resonates for you, but you are definitely spiritual, whether you are just, or whether you're just spiritual or you are religious and spiritual, but the, the spiritual realm is calling. Spirit is calling. You are very spiritually protected. Um, you're never alone with spirit here. Co-create with spirit. I mean, it is all over the place in here, you guys. Whoever you are, masculine or feminine. Oh, my gosh. Wow, this is a great one. I feel a lot of spiritualist Pisces watch these videos or they're about to. How that resonates. Dragon, beware self-delusion. A very low vibrational feminine Pisces has been stalking a feminine Leo. It is about to really, really, really seriously backfire on her in a huge way. Huge. Huge negative tower moments coming. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. Holy crap. Okay. So you plug it in, how it resonates. It's been going good. Um, very, I want to say these, I feel, are very high vibrational energies here. I feel these are very high vibrational energies or you're about to become high vibrational. However that resonates in your life, only you know your story, not anybody else, okay? So however that resonates, okay? Um, but this person is very low vibrational. Now, of course, you only take the messages that resonate, but this person is very low vibrational. Um, I heard it's a feminine Pisces, Piscean energy. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, hey, energy of your charts. But I heard they're very heavily stalking a Leo femme. So whoever the Leo femme is that they're very heavily stalking, I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Negative power moments coming for them. So, I mean, you know, negative power moments. I mean, you can't play around with negative power moments. I mean, no, I don't like to play around with negative power moments. I'm sure you don't either. Ah. Um, let me see if I can find it. I was talking about the tower card yesterday in a reading. Let's see. Ah, I did a reading with these today, so it's not up here. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, for those of you new and you're not maybe familiar, but uh, tower energy coming, negative tower moment energy. It's a feminine Pisces. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising towers. I heard plural towers, two plus towers, you guys. Where is my tower card? Um, however that resonates, this is holy crap. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, if you're not this low vibrational Pisces, you might be connected to her, possibly. Um, only you know your story, not anybody else. Negative tower moments coming. And yes, it looks scary, but um, in this sense, it is negative. So you, I mean, towers can be positive or negative. Depending on how you grow a manifest them, the situation, etc., etc., etc. In this case, it is negative, but in all fairness, she's stalking a Leo feminine. Who, I mean, you shouldn't stalk anybody anytime, any shape, form, or fashion, period. Um, so I think it's for this low vibrational Pisces, beware of self delusion. She's self, maybe she's delusional. Maybe she's having mental health issues, um, is what I'm feeling here, possibly. Severe mental health issues here. Is about to be made very known very public very soon. Oh my lord. Whoa. I heard severe mental health issues here. Severe. It's about to be made uh, known very public very soon. So yeah, she has severe mental health issues, this low vibrational Pisces. Um, and it's about to be made very known very public very soon. So much so she's stalking another feminine energy. I mean, that's terrible. Um Hashtag live free. Just saying. Oh, crap, you guys. Secret. A masculine Pisces energy, 35 and below. For some, a baby mother is keeping a huge secret, secret from you. 
For some, your wife is. You will find it out soon. For some, it is a positive surprise. For some, it is extremely negative. Oh, okay. Well, this is good and bad. This is good and bad. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So you're 35 or below Pisces masculine. For some, I feel you're not married, legally married. For some, I feel you are. Um, for some, it's your baby mama. So I feel they could either be currently pregnant or already have a child or children by you. You plug it in, how it resonates. And for whoever that is, I don't feel you're legally married to them. You might have be legally married to somebody else, but not them. Um, or single, how that resonates. And for some, you're legally married. Uh, for some, I heard your wife is keeping a huge secret from you. For some, it's positive, positive surprise. So like a su positive surprise, I'm feeling. For some, it is very, very negative. But however that resonates, you're about to learn it soon. Married, 35 or below, Pisces masculine. 35 or below Pisces masculine, not married to the baby mama, same thing. Um, it's They're holding some kind of secret energy from you. Um, it's either very positive, like surprise party, surprise gift energy, surprise something positive energy, uh, surprise some something, something positive energy, or very negative surprise, like negative power moment surprise. So you plug it in, how it resonates. For some, you could be dealing with Pisces because the secret in this um, this deck is Piscean energy, um, possibly, or can or Cancer. Um, it's Piscean and Cancer energy, Cancerian. Um, you, they could have possibly have Pisces or Cancer in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or the Midheaven or Jupiter charts. If you are, possibly for some, you have to plug it in, how it resonates. Okay, but whether you're dealing with a Piscean or a Cancer feminine energy or not, their secrets there either positive or negative, either your legally married spouse or your baby mama S type energy. How, whether you're dating her, not dating her, or just co-parenting with her. Dedication, or she's currently pregnant with the child or children ears too. Dedication. A particular Pisces masculine is about to get married to a currently pregnant person that they've been pregnated. They do not want to do this. They're being heavily pressured by family to do this. Several shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this situation. One of these Piscean masculines will get out of this. Whoa, Pisces. You a lot of Piscean masculine energy in here. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, whoa, Pisces masculine. Um, okay, so you have impregnated somebody in the universe, whoever it is. Um, it doesn't sound like it meant for it to happen. I'll tell you that. It doesn't sound like for it you meant for it to happen. Um, I'm just being thrilled, okay? But there's at least two of you guys, okay? But you're being heavily pressured by your family to do it. I feel they're currently pregnant. I feel for some of these uh, Pisces masculine, your current feminine, soon to be baby mama, they're they're currently pregnant is what I'm feeling. Either like newly, like not even first trimester pregnant or they're baby bumping it big. Uh, third trimester maybe. I don't know. But um, however that resonates, I feel they're currently pregnant. But I heard you're being heavily pressured by your family to get married to this person for societal norms um, is what I'm presuming here. Outdated belief systems, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but I heard for one of you guys, well, it sounds like both of you guys, many shocking series of chain events are about to occur for both situations. But for one of you guys, it sounds like the shocking series of chain events, now whatever the crap they are and how they apply in your life, only you know your story, not anybody else, it's going to get you out of it. I heard you really don't want to do it. Both of you really, really, really don't want to do it. But you are just experiencing such heavy pressure from your family, man, that it's just like forcing your, literally your hand into a wedding band. Oh, that's terrible. Um, but um, for one of you guys, the shocking series of chain of events sounds like it's going to get you out of it. I feel for one of you guys, and I didn't hear this from the spiritual realm, but I feel for one of you guys, you're about to find out these this. Fetus or fetuses is not your kid, is what I'm feeling. 
That could be the secret energy too for some. And the beware of self-delusion. You thought it was your kid. Maybe you're going to get a paternity test. Because you, or you really don't want to do it. You really, really, really don't want to do it. Well, if you really don't want to do it and you're suspecting it's not your child, if I was you, of course, you could take the advice or leave it. If I was you, I'd get a paternity test done. And I'm serious about that. But, of course, you only, you know your story, not anybody else. I'm not telling, it's not my place on the spiritual realm or this video to tell you what to do. Okay? Only you make your decisions, not anybody else. Okay? Bless you. All right, let me see if I hear anything. Bless you. A Pisces is about to help a Leo feminine get their children back soon through many shocking series of chain of events. Oh my gosh. Well, that's beautiful. You plug it in how it resonates. Wow. Heard of Pisces is about to help a Leo Femme get their children back through many shocking series of chain of events. Um, whoever, um, you're a high vibrational Pisces, whoever you are. You're not this person. Whoever this person is, they are, yikes. Um, you're high vibrational, whoever you are. Um, Pisces, um, masculine or femme. You could be masculine or femme. Pisces, you could have Pisces in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine here with Jupiter charts. I'm feeling very high, high vibrational energy from you, whoever you are. Um, sir or ma'am. Um, but I heard you're about to help a Leo feminine get their kids back. So they're either in a custody, current custody battle right now, um, fighting for custody, um, like McClendon standard energy, possibly, or they have already lost custody of their children, or... Something has happened where their children is not, or not with them right now, um, in some shape, form, or fashion. But you're about to help be a catalyst and a game changer. Um, a you're about to be a positive tower moment in this situation. Because like I said, this can be positive or negative, depending on how you grow manifested. You're about to be a positive tower moment to this Leo feminine. They could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, him, or Jupiter charts. Now, however, you're going to be a positive tower moment to them. You only you know your story, not anybody else. And that could be the dedication too. You're about to be dedicated to the situation um, to help them get their kids back. Maybe you know a secret. I'm feeling for some, you know a secret. And you're about to reveal it. And it's going to help them get their kids back. I heard kids. So they at least have two plus kids in the universe is what I'm feeling. Because I heard kids, plural. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, you plug in how it resonates. All right, you guys, well, we're done. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.